before I start today's video, I request you all to follow and support my new YouTube channel that is Justetech 2.0. You will get the channel link from the description. Please support this channel and subscribe it and also press the bell icon so that you will never miss the new update. Hey everyone, this is Justetech and welcome back to the channel. So this video is very important for all of those who are currently on the latest iOS 16 and want to downgrade to iOS 15 and it is important because maybe this is the last chance you can downgrade to iOS 15 as maybe you will see this video after a week or three to four days later or maybe tomorrow and it might have possibility that this process will not work so longer so you need to be very quick so if you want to downgrade you can see and downgrade immediately after seeing this video and as you know the ios 15 is currently unsigned by apple that means you cannot restore or flash to that version but many of you are already updated to ios 16 on their normal iphones or maybe the activation lock or already bypassed device but you want to bypass it with sim as as well at that support the ios 15.7.1 and below and you want to downgrade ios for your normal iphones or for your jailbreak purposes so i will just show you how you can do that so let me just go to my computer screen and start this process all right to so the downgrade is available for mostly all the iphones or ipad model so if you have a iphone 13 pro max and lower you can downgrade easily to the iOS 15. So right now I'm on the IPSW.me official website and you can check out all the IPSW here which is signed and unsigned. Right now I have a iPhone 8 Global that is currently on the latest 16.1 and it's on the activation lock device and I want to downgrade it to iOS 15 to support the SIM bypass and this majorly if you have a iCloud bypass device the iPhone 8, 8 Plus and iPhone X is mostly common use for the iOS 16 as the lower device not getting the iOS us 16 update so for these devices it's useful or if for the above model like iphone xr xs iphone 11 iphone 12 series iphone 13 pro max you can downgrade it for the future jailbreak process so you need to go to my website and click on the ios signing status option after that you will get on this page now you need to select your iphones or ipad model from the list it depends on if you have a global or gsm and you can check the identifier also as per your model so I have a iPhone 8 global version so I will select that. You can check the complete list here and which are the signed version for your device. So let me just select the iPhone 8 global. So now you can see that the latest iOS 16.1 is signed as long with that some betas version of iOS 16 also signed but we don't need those just below down there is the iOS 15 RC update is also available for iOS 15.6 and 15.7 RC update. But I need to mention one very careful point, the iOS 15.7 RC update currently not signed but on the website it's still showing the signed green status but don't download that 15.7, only use the 15.6 that is currently signed. So make sure you follow this step very carefully. If you flash it with a 15.7 version, you face some SSH error. So only use the 15.6 RC version build number 19G69 for your iPhone 8, 8 Plus, iPhone X and all above model up to the iPhone 13 Pro Max series. So only use the 15.6. I need to mention this. Maybe after some time the website will update and unsigned this 15 point rc version so don't use that and also make sure you are using the latest itunes from the apple website don't download it from the microsoft store you can go below and you will get the windows version directly from the apple website so you can download this for the 64 and 32 bit also you will require the latest 3 tools so make sure all these things are updated and downloaded from the official website so now we are ready you have to download the 15.6 rc version only don't use the 15.7 now you need to just check your itunes is updated so you can check from that option now you need to go to the flash and update options now from here you need to import the 15.6 rc ipsw file you have just downloaded from that website so i will import that after the import and verify you are ready to downgrade your ios version make sure that you will select the clean flash option instead of the user retain option so make sure you download the right ipsw according to your device and select the quick flash option now once everything set click on flash
all right now it's done and as you can see that we have successfully flashed our device and downgrade is completed from ios 16 to the 15.6 rc version now you are ready to bypass your device with the sim based bypass tool like i remove tools checkmate smd for ios 15 and you can also do the without sim bypass with hfz activator all the videos are on my channel so you can check that or you can check out the description link you will get the direct links for that so by this way you can follow the same process for the activation lock and normal device also for the passcode and the disable screen the process is different i will make a separate video soon on that so how you can downgrade that devices also so that's all for this video and don't forget to check out my new youtube channel just to take 2.0 i will see you in the next video so till then goodbye take care and peace out